white holes, the theoretical opposite of black holes. There's a lot of talk about white holes, but what actually are they? To understand that, we need to take a brief detour into the world of black holes. Black holes have a very particular property. They have an event horizon. That's the boundary of a region of space from which nothing can escape, not even light. Once something crosses the event horizon, it can never come back out. And that's because the gravity of the black hole is just too strong. It pulls things in and crushes them. Now, white holes are supposed to be the opposite of black holes. But instead of pulling things in, they would push things away. If you were near a white hole, everything would be moving so fast you wouldn't be able to stand still. You'd be swept up and blasted away. The only difference between a white hole and a black hole is that with a white hole, once you cross the horizon, instead of being crushed, you would be flung out into space. You'd be like a space traveler who accidentally entered the wrong wormhole. Instead of coming out on the other side of the universe, you come out on the other side of a black hole. And if you happen to survive the trip, you would find yourself outside a white hole. The problem is, we have no evidence that white holes even exist. We can't observe them directly because they don't emit any light or any other kind of electromagnetic radiation. Since we can't see them, astronomers have never actually observed a white hole. So the question is, are white holes just a mathematical curiosity, or do they actually exist? Well, it depends on whether you believe in multiverses. You see, white holes are often associated with wormholes. A wormhole is a theoretical tunnel that connects two different points in space-time. If you were to blast through a wormhole, you could end up on the other side of a black hole, where you would then be ejected out of a white hole. Now, the idea of wormholes is taken seriously by some physicists, while others dismiss them as just science fiction. And since no one has ever observed a wormhole, we really don't know how they work or even if they exist at all. If you want to learn more about black holes, subscribe and follow us. Thanks for watching.